Once the cookie is completely dry, I'll use my Smart Sketcher projector to help me finish the cookie. I start off by searching for the image that I would like to use for this specific cookie. In this case, it's hand sanitizer. You can definitely save an image directly to your phone. However, for this specific cookie, I am screenshotting. I like to minimize the image so that it's a little bit smaller and screenshot that one. And I'll do a different size as well, just so that I can have multiple options when I'm testing out which one will work best with the projector and this cookie. Now we'll move to the Smart Sketcher app. Keep in mind you'll have to pair your phone via Bluetooth when you first open up your projector. Since I've already done that, I'll just click on I have a Smart Sketcher. And because my Bluetooth is on and the projector is on, it'll automatically connect. It may take a few seconds. From here, you'll go ahead and click the red circle with the camera icon. And on the bottom right, you'll see the preview to some of the images on your phone. From here, the gallery will pop up and you can click which image you'd like to use. There are three different settings. Find the one that works for you. Once you select your image, the projector will display the image just as it showed you in the preview. This is how it worked out for the first one. From here, I chose to use an edible pen to help me complete this label, but you can use royal icing if you're more comfortable with that as well. Here's an example of an image I saved directly to my phone. You can see that the image projects very largely and will not fit the three inch cookie that I'm trying to decorate. Unfortunately, this projector doesn't have the option to zoom in or out, but the way around that for me is adjusting the height to where the cookie sits. I'll do that by placing cake boards or cake pans, whatever I have available to adjust the height of the cookie. 
You'll notice as the cookie gets closer to the projector, the image projected does get smaller. It still gives me enough room to be able to comfortably decorate this cookie. And for the $40 on the projector, I'm not too worried about having to make the adjustments every now and then. You can't really beat the price point on this. At $40, it gives me the capability to help me decorate my cookies so that they're a lot more uniformed. And I really don't do cookies that often, so I'm not too bothered by having to make the adjustments or not being able to zoom in or out. That's perfectly fine with me. If you're somebody who will be needing those features, I definitely recommend looking at other options before you purchase this one. And like with anything else, it may take you a little bit of practice to get used to it, but if you just keep messing around with the pictures and the sizing, I'm sure you'll definitely get the hang of it.